Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave and I'm back with more reactions with an X. This time we are headed into, I think it's 997, the episode of One Piece that's gonna pop off. I already know it is because I know it's gonna happen from the title I saw because man is it hard to avoid titles in One Piece, you know what I mean? Still, um, I think it's gonna be an interesting episode. We already know they're gearing up heavily for episode 1000. They released like a trailer and everything, which we might actually go watch because I already pretty much know what's going to happen in episode 1000, I think. And yeah, that's still not to the point where I had been reading. I still haven't caught up reading and I'm debating on going forward not and just reacting fresh to the anime. But we honestly don't have too many viewers on our episodes and I don't know if there's if I'd rather do that or just go for it, you know what I mean? And uh, go ahead on the manga because I've heard the manga popping off and it's probably almost 20 plus chapters from where I last read so it's been a minute I haven't read for probably a couple months at least which is saying something for me because I love One Piece but watching the anime helps get me along plus chatting with you guys in discord on YouTube as well as all the other people I know who watch and make One Piece content I mean it's a great community and I hope you love it with that said we're gonna hop into the episode I already ranted too long for my liking but remember to support the original content creators because if we don't support them, well, we just don't get more great content. And in this case, the cheer up, O to the go to the god, is worth every penny. Uh, also, big shout out to our patrons. Without you guys, definitely wouldn't have the motivation to keep doing this kind of fun stuff. So I appreciate that dollar a month or more that you guys give. And I hope you enjoy the exclusive content access, full audio, full video, and all that great stuff. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and get into it uh, right about now. <laughs> Oh, he's injured. He's breathing heavy. Holding his side. Damn, his eyes already tore up. Did I miss something? They're all tore up just from that one attack. Damn. That's all he did was like push him back once, right? Oh. Look at that. Look at that aura. It is dumb. Oh, here come the news. I feel like this is just like when it happened in Dressrosa in a lot of ways. So. Okay, I love his I love his surprise voice though. His, yep, there they go. Oh, that is a cool scene. It's a really interesting switch from the like lit party section to this, where it's like the snow and cold and Look at I, I do like Queen's little snail though. That's just funny. <laughs> His snail died. What the fuck? Oh wow, this music again. Is this like Killer's track? Damn, nice. <laughs> Dude, his ability is just so fucking strong. Amputate. See, I like that one because it's a very like interesting, continuous use of his abilities, where it shows like, yeah, he's his slash is faster than that, right? Whatever they shot at him, and that then attack is like instantaneous. But I like that all of the snails are different people, though they didn't just like generically make a bunch of snails. That's a lot of work. Good job. Enemy raid. Oh, now they care. Now that they now that they know there's a lot of people there, they're like, oh, it's just Luffy, the fifth Yonko or Gonko or whatever. Goko. Oh man, there she is. Come on. Yep. She's gotta get him out of there. I, I think it's Chancel. I love the mix of English sometimes. I wish I guess English does that actually. We, we borrow words, so that's pretty typical. I like you like how they skipped his whole like transformation by doing the um the flash of the face. It was still cool, I'm just saying. World's greatest military power. So interesting. <laughs>
I'm still waiting to do for the two sword stuff to come up. Yeah, I remember this. This is so dope. This is so dope. I forgot the title of the episode, guys, but I shouldn't have because this is actually legitly one of the dopest things, I swear. Look at him, look at him, look at him. This is going to be so cool. And probably beautiful. Like, maybe that's why they did all this recap is because of the animation here. I love um, Dog Storm and Cat Vipers too long for him. It is so dope. Ah, so they brought something they knew he, yeah, he knew they'd go after. Oh my god, look at that guy's dumbass body, the one with the fucking, like, monkey for a fucking torso. He always sounds injured and old. Dogstorm. To be fair, you was lying. You were 100% lying. <laughs> this is... I mean, that doesn't excuse their actions, I'm just saying. Wait, because you got beat up by an elephant? I know the irony was palpable, but don't be a bitch about it. You know what I mean? I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping too. Smack, bitch! Get bitch smacked, bitch! Oof, damn that. I forgot how fucked up he looked. Oh yeah, you better do it. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, there it is. I think their forms were pretty dope too, but from the... If I remember in the manga, they were a little less even detailed or defined. Like a lot, some of them were even just in shadows, I think. But it's been a minute, so I could be totally wrong, man. It's been a, a second. Oof. They're pretty... They're doing these better than they did in the... Manga, the, the, the side characters, I think. No, this is kind of what they look like. They were kind of like all a little similar and less dis, dis, the, descript, I guess. Maybe these guys. But the, the tough part is when they all turn white and their hair all puffs out like that, they look very, very similar. Oh, man. Okay, guys, we get it. Yo, roaring. Roddy and BB, the Weld Forest Guardians. I didn't know that one, guys. Giovanni, Shishi Leon, and uh, Consulat Dogstorm's three musketeers. Jack. So you got Jack, a number. I like that they had specific numbers. I didn't remember the numbers having specific numbers, but I think it's because when I read it in Japanese, the number was printed in Japanese, probably. They stopped this thing. Yep. Nani? Boys, it's a clap. Oh, yeah, here we go. No, they're. I knew it. I fucking knew it. I was like, here we go. And then I'm like, nah, they're gonna fuck us. All right, well, we knew. We knew that was what they were gonna do. That's what they like to do, right? So I'm not gonna be all pissy about it or any of that. Um, I didn't even yell because I knew it was coming. I, fig I figured it out like a second earlier. I was like, wait. And then I'm like, but at least we got some of the Sulong stuff. I was really wanting to see Dogstorm and Cat Vibers because their Sulong forms are dope. Whereas I feel like the Sulong form stuff for all of the, you know, subordinates is less developed and well formed. They're, they're made to look more similar and kind of like a mass group of like almost white shadows i'd say with red eyes so that they can they're just very menacing and powerful and they they did put in work obviously against jack and the numbers and it is cool in the manga in here to see them put in work and being a piece of the puzzle which i do like one piece does that they're not like well 
Which is so funny because they even went out of their way to make Conker's hockey so they could do that where they'd be like, ah, well, they could just say fuck the fodder. But they've done a really good job of kind of ignoring that <laughs> lately and being like, all right, well, we're just going to give the fodder their own kind of fodder to fight. And not saying anyone on either side is fodder, but just comparatively to their leaders, right? Like, you know what I mean? Um, none of none of those guys, even Jack, is half a match for Kaido, right? Like, that's just the way it is. But with that said, I, I really enjoyed it. I think it's great. We're obviously going to pop off with the three more episodes because we have 98, 99, well, two more episodes before 1,000, and then 1,000 going to be uh, the great big, right? I mean, shoot, like, what other anime has got to 1,000 episodes, I wonder? I don't even know off the top of my head if I can think of one. But I'm proud of Shiro Oda. He's worked so hard for this, and I don't blame him for kind of working himself now towards the end of it i think he's gonna kind of rush towards the end in my opinion that's what i'm foreseeing i haven't read the new chapters but if i had to guess because he he's probably gonna try to finish it in another 100 or 200 chapters maybe but i think that he needed the 500 that he had set himself like a year or two ago i can't remember which would mean another three or so and i think he needs that he needs a whole nother arc at least to finish right where it's the big summit war and you figure out whatever is going on with shanks and the one piece and all the everything right which will need at least probably 300 chapters to really wrap all that up in a really good nice bow uh and probably more honestly in my opinion for his typical style because even wano i felt not so much in the anime but very much in the manga i felt was rushed uh compared to his other stuff it's still very very good and arguably could be one of the better or best uh arcs but i do feel like compared to what it could have been and what it, what he was usually planning for it was a bit rushed um but still great uh with that said thanks for watching guys i really appreciate everybody who watched whether it be on youtube or patreon but special shout out to the patrons obviously you guys pay a dollar to get the uncut full video full audio every week so hopefully I, you can enjoy that let me know if you want any specific series and all that great stuff for everyone on youtube i love you guys as well i really do appreciate every like comment and view as well as the critiques because i need to improve myself and my reactions and i'm trying to do so every week so just let me know how i can do better either there or come check out our discord where you can tell me the same things and see all the fun memes and stuff we post those will all be in the links below and i think that's pretty much it you know support the original content creator as always because achira oda is a goda and is he's just dope man like he made such a great story and i can't get over how well he wrote it and planned it and is still doing it so props to him and all the hard work he's put in as well as everybody following along and helping him create stuff so let's uh let's hope to get more stuff by supporting him and uh i think i'll see you guys next time on reactions with the next one piece